Oh boy, oh boy. Many of you will be very excited about this. Chipotle is working on some new menu items. Breaking news for food lovers, queso is coming to Chipotle. If you're a Chipotle fan, the restaurant has announced nationwide they're going to release the new queso dip. Like a kid on Christmas. There are three times more Chipotle than Cadobas in this world. It's time they get on board with the good stuff. Because even if it's a bus, I'm still going to go to Chipotle. But the question that everyone has been asking since the 90s, Chipotle, where's the queso? Where the F is your queso. You know that we want it. This is democracy. What the people want, the people get. The company avoided the dip for quite a while because most queso does contain some artificial ingredients that goes against Chipotle's promise. You know, we do the whole food with integrity thing, right? Yeah. Queso has to be made with artificial stabilizers to keep its shiny liquid form. But today, September 12, 2017, will go down in infamy because today, hit them with it. It's the day that Chipotle brings queso to the game. Chipotle says you'll be able to get that cheese dip on Tuesday, September the 12th. The company, of course, first announced they were testing it out, this queso, back in July. And you know your boys in number six with cheese are gonna go cop that right now? Yeah, boys! We don't talk like that normally. Let's go eat. Boys and girls, are you ready? Are you ready? Today is the day we've been waiting for, maybe my whole life. It's finally here. Queso, baby. Do you think there's a magical cow that squirts queso out of its udders, Larry? This video is Cadoba versus Chipotle. Queso. Mm, let's get ready to rumble. Chipotle and Cadoba queso acquired. Jump cut. What? Welcome to a very special episode of this show. Maybe the most special we've ever done. If you're normally watching our videos, this is probably freaking you out. Probably a little weirded out. Why is he on the left? Why is he on the right? Is something changing? What happened? Now we're just using my car today. Deal with it. And also, a very special thing is we're not just comparing chips and cheese against each other. We got a whole array. Some would say a smorgasbord. A smorgasbord of crazy. Let's show you what you're working with. Bye, who next? So I'm gonna go straight for the goods. Give these guys an idea what we got here. Yeah, yeah. This is what we've been waiting for. Chipotle. Oh, damn. Queso. Oh, damn. So we got two of those. Mm -hmm. Oh, damn. We've got chips so we can see what it's like just in the chip game, obviously, right? Obviously. Oh, damn. A burrito from Chipotle. So we're going to mess around with that. Queso on this, of course. Queso on that, of course. Oh, damn. And then in the Catoba world, chips and, of course, their queso for comparison. And also they give you way more. Way more. Initial thoughts, way more. Oh damn. Good to know, good to think about. And then this will be what you guys know is a wonderful. Big. Damn, that's a lot. Cadoba burrito. Interesting, I've never held them next to each other. Yeah, I wonder what. Just for fun. the same, pretty similar. We got similar items on there. We're gonna mess it up. Now you might think we're done, but you'd be out of your goddamn mind. Also, not to mention, these burritos are the exact same thing. Everything on the Chipotle one is the exact same on the Cadoba one. We wanna make it as even as possible. It's all here. chicken, it's all the same beans, it's all the same vegetables, everything. We also got two White Castle sliders. Yeah. We, we went weird with what we want to sample queso with. Two egg rolls. Four pizza rolls. Pizza rolls. Two dog dicks in a bread bowl. Weird pigs in a blanket. And two soft pretzels. So we're gonna gonna try the shit out of this uh, this queso. Cause it's like, yeah, your queso might be you good by it, itself, but it. I wanna know how good it is with other food. We like a lot of food. Mm -hmm. We do a lot of back and forth, I think. We'll okay. do a little try, a little try, a little try, a little try. Oh. Chipotle first so we know bare bones, nothing's been in my mouth. Right. Here's your chip, sir. Yeah, let me give it a little sniff test. Smells like cheese. Smells like queso. Wow, this is a big moment. This is a big moment. Way liquidier. This is what people when I like 10 years ago, whenever I would uh discuss people when I never had Cadoba, that looks weird, but I like it. People like, you gotta go to Cadoba, they got queso there. Be like, be this like, is a yeah. big moment in the series. Okay. Chipotle queso for the first time. Also, this is on the day it comes out. Yeah. Nationally. Cheers. Mm. Whoa. <laughs> I actually don't mind that. That's just not what I expected it to taste like. I don't mind it. No, I like that. I heard a lot of bad things about this. So maybe it's because my, like I thought it was going to be bad. My mm -hmm. standards are so low. This is not bad. I had really low expectations for this, even though I love Cado or, uh, Chipotle. So here's the thing. If you forgot why Chipotle hasn't done this, is because they don't want to add any food stabilizers. Anything artificial to keep it binded. So this is going to taste way more like actual melted cheese. Anyone else have any new ideas? Well, I got one. It better be good this time, Larry. It is. One word, queso. 
Do you want to try it relative to Cadoba now? Yeah, I'm gonna do one more. One more. I think three chips and three dips is good. I uh, I'm actually liking this. Yeah, I don't mind that at all. It's delightful. Yeah, that's not bad. Mm -mm. I thought it was gonna be like, oh, I don't want any more of that. hot trash. I'm yep. definitely excited to eat this mm -hmm. and dip other stuff in it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now the massive queso they give you at Cadoba. Way lighter in color. Thank you, Chip Boy. Chip okay. Boy. So much more queso. I like that. Cheers, Cadoba. Yeah, and it does taste better to me. Initial thoughts, I thought they'd be way different tasting. Yeah, they're way more similar than I expected. Without a doubt. There's just a, a hint of that being better. The chipotle queso tastes a little more like actual food. I don't know how else to describe it. Yeah. Yeah, this tastes like way more, I mean, it just I'm assuming it's more unhealthy. I hope I don't have any placebo going on. This is way saltier. Mm -hmm. It tastes like it's riddled with way more sodium, which I don't care about. When I'm eating queso, I'm not going, well, it's a good queso. Yeah. It's okay. If you're downing an entire queso on your lunch break in an office job. You don't care if it's healthy queso. Don't tell me you're having a productive afternoon. Right. That's, That's great. phenomenal. They're both so good. All right, what do you want to do, sliders? They're probably the most disgusting. Yeah, so these are everybody's favorite slider joint in America with cheese all over it. This is way better than I expected. Agree. That tasted pretty good. White Castle in Cadoba queso. Yeah, similar, but I gotta give that the green check mark of ding. That's the winner for that one. For sliders? Yeah, I gotta go Cadoba. Cadoba queso. Let's do soft pretzels. Same soft same. pretzels, such a classic with uh. Are with I at a cheese. baseball game? Yeah, yeah right? this is like the most iconic thing to eat with to melted eat, cheese. Yes, absolutely. These pretzels. I'm making me thirsty! Uh oh, don't fall apart. Don't you do it. Chipotle queso. I should just be holding this. That's a good idea. That doesn't taste very good with the pretzel, necessarily. No, it doesn't have enough flavor popping off of it to make the bland pretzel better. And this does. Mm. This has been the most distinct that I can tell that this is better. This accentuates other flavors way better than this so far. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So what are you thinking? Soft pretzels? Cadoba queso. Obviously. Boom. Right? Yeah. Dude, Cadoba's on a goddamn roll. They're tearing it. You select. Pizza rolls. Pizza rolls, Totinos, Chipotle, queso. I'm starting to sense a theme. Yeah. So that's cheese mixed with cheese. So we're adding a whole new ballpark. Which that was really good. It was really good. But hard to get a flavor profile on that. Yeah. 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 Ah, uh, yeah. On the actual cheese. Let's see what we got. Could open queso. I can just taste this queso more. Which cheese? I gotta go with Cadoba. Uh oh. And I love Chipotle. Cadoba queso. What do you want to go with now? Egg rolls. Egg rolls. Something that people don't do is they don't dip egg rolls in queso. But on this show, we dip it in queso. I'll dip anything in queso. Mmm. Whoa. Whoa. That Start good. dipping egg rolls in queso. Yeah, note to self. Make it a part of your routine. Mm hmm. Note to self. Lather it up. Egg rolls. Okay, so. Oh my gosh, so much better. Mm-hmm. It's just really interesting that head to head with just on chips, it really wasn't that a very drastic. big distinction. But now I'm I'm tasting it's, a very big distinction. It's like a flavor enhancer. Yeah. It's like this does a better job of taking whatever flavors you got and throwing them on a quick steroid boost. <laughs> we we get it. It was it wasn't it was a, a bad decision. Queso can really help a fried this thing is like torched. Mm-hmm. Pigs in a blanket. Pig. Oh no, my pig came out of my blanket. Oh no, scoop him out. <laughs> Are you turned on? <sighs> I hope not. I hope that didn't turn anybody on. <laughs> that queso didn't help much. No. Dude, I'm this is just an overpowering flavor. It just beats up on Chipotle. It's so hardcore. I mean, what are we going for? Cadoba queso. Dude, I got you. I can't lie to you guys. Chipotle's like that nice guy. In high school, you're like, oh man, that's like nice. I really, no, I like it, man. It's good. But then this is that dude that's like, oh yeah, well, that dude's badass. He's cool as hell. Like, of course you want to kick it with him. He's the one who always gets beer for that's parties. That's actually a really good breakdown. Like, there's nothing wrong with Chipotle queso. No, it's, it's great. just when it's, you compare it to. I like it. A company that's been doing it for 20 years. This dude will just fight. This dude will just knock He'll that dude out. down. He owns a set of brass knuckles. Mm -hmm. He's not renting him from his buddy Chuck. He owns some. Yeah, no kidding. 
the big, burrito time. The big dog. Oh yeah, you want me to cut these? Yeah, sorry, we don't have the tables in this car. Let's see. Now, probably the biggest deal is a Chipotle burrito with queso versus a Cadoba burrito with queso. Same ingredients against each other. I'm going with the perforated edge method. We obviously both don't need an entire full burrito from each place, so we're doing the smart thing so we don't look like sea monsters. Excuse me, sea monster, you weigh like a thousand pounds. Yeah? yeah? I bet you'd like to swim with this sea monster, wouldn't you? Remember when perforated, they didn't have any knives. Remember when perforated edges on notebook paper first came out? Sure do. Which, Big moment in school. Which makes me su feel super old. I bet there's a lot of human beings who don't remember when that actually came out. There's probably a lot of humans that think that the trees just shoot off perforated paper. <laughs> there were definitely years where I was the poor kid who was like, oh, I wish I could have the perforated edges. So tell me that didn't work pretty well. You're just great at that. Thank you, Corey. Mm -hmm. Damn, you did a great job and you used a fork, a mm -hmm. plastic fork. So Lord. this is Chipotle. Yep. Cheers. Mm. I feel like this is a real test too. I really do too. This is what people get. Mm -hmm. They get a burrito, they're gonna get queso on it. 75% of the people that walk into Chipotle, I better get in a burrito. Mm -hmm. Or a bowl. And now they're gonna get queso on it. Either way, it's gonna be these ingredients mixed together. It's not gonna be chips. Some of them do obviously, but. Keep in mind, Cadoba is still doing no extra charge for queso on a burrito, while Chipotle- That's true. Damn near $2 extra. No kidding. So, this is gonna be one of those things where it needs to drastically improve the burrito's yep. taste for you to get it. Cause not too many people are gonna vary up their orders. That's why I don't get guac. I love guac, you only got like guac, you know? Love guac, but I'm not paying two bucks for it. I'm not paying for it. Maybe one day, when this series takes off, I'll have guac money. Right now, we ain't got no guac I money, I got no dog. guac money. All right. This is really good. Remember I said chicken, pinto beans, white rice with cilantro, fajita peppers, sour cream, hot salsa, the cheese and lettuce. Side. Nice shred job. Yeah, Thank Cadoba's you. looks... Healthier? Yeah, it kind of does, right? It looks fresher. Mm-hmm. Which I can't imagine is true. All right, I've been getting babied with those trays. I didn't even think about yeah, it. Yeah, dude. All right, Cadoba queso burrito. Mmm. Wow. Oops. This tastes even healthier. This is the first time I've also eaten burritos like this next to each other at all. Mm -hmm. So not only am I comparing the quesos, I'm comparing like the consistency of the tortilla, the taste of the rice, how easy it is to bite through it all, how mixed up the ingredients are. You know, you really get, oh yeah, you're going, that's such a good idea, dude. Look at this, we're double fisting. We're like a couple of, instead of college kids drinking beer. Dude. Obvious choice. I like the Ch Chipotle one as an overall better. Wow. Burrito or queso? Just overall the burrito with the queso. Okay. As like a total package. For sure. And I think it went really well with that. Not that the Kudoba's bad, but just no. as a total package, I'm still, I'm gonna go Chipotle. You know, if I take pricing consideration and the fact that it costs extra for the cheese, I would not. Right. See? Ate about a fourth of each. What do you think? That's interesting. I did not expect that. It's a little more disguised. It's a little bit less in your face. The cheese is right. on the burrito. Right. I'm gonna tell you this. As a whole package, with the queso on it, the way it's made, the way it tastes with all the ingredients, the Chipotle burrito is better. Yeah. The Cadoba burrito, I guess I'm starting to now realize really how different they are. Yeah, because I've never had them side by side. The burritos are so different. Everything about it, the way it holds, the way it tastes, the way it kind of maintains itself throughout your eating experience. I know it sounds like a big stoner or something, but like, well, but seriously, the queso in the Chipotle burrito works better than yeah. it does on the Cadoba burrito. And after burrito. trying all that crap, that is not what I freaking expected. The taste of the Cadoba cheese by itself or with like fried foods. Or chip better. or anything, yeah. It's better. I'm gonna have some more individual. Check your homework. You know when you're in school and they say check your work? I cannot wait to hear what you guys think. This yeah. is gonna be a really fun debate. I've heard a lot of people say, right away, nope, 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 this. Yeah. Better with chips. I think Chipotle makes a better encased burrito in general, so the queso helps with that. Yeah, I think I'm so. Now, I'm now on Team Chipotle for burrito itself. Wow. But the taste of that on your tongue really is so different after you have this. So different. Yeah, I prefer no. this 10 out of 10 times if I'm eating it out of receptacle. Yeah, no it's kidding. so much better. I'm like, Freaking mind blown right now because that's not. I expected that the burrito was gonna be better too. Oh man, this is so good. Jesus. But I like huh. the Chipotle burrito better. Mm hmm. Man, I'm so shocked at my everything right now. Nobody cares, Sean. I'm glad we compared it in such unique ways. Yeah, me too. Average Joe's gonna go out and just eat both and go, this one's better. We went to the grocery store. We got different kinds of foods. Yeah, it gave a good idea of. We tried it with five or six it, yeah. different alternatives. It really gave you. Now I feel like I definitely know. 
I feel like a scientist. Yeah, I'm a scientist, and welcome to the lab of number six. Dude, this is so good. I love this queso. Man, that is crazy. Mind blowing all over the room. You gotta burrito, go. gotta go Chipotle. Got to, got to. Shocking. Everything else though? Cadoba. Cadoba. So whatever you decide what means more to you. It's like, this is gonna be a crazy comparison, but it's like Vince Carter, MJ. Who are you gonna go? MJ, who's the better player? Always. Who's the better shooter? MJ. Who's the better everything? MJ. But who's the better dunker? <laughs> it's Vince close, Car but Vince Carter was a better dunker. Vince Carter, you know, in game, out game. So being at a burrito is like dunking. I think so. That's the <laughs> thing that people go to games to watch. Don't forget to comment below with what you like the best. We'd love to hear from that. We read all the comments. We just want to make this a conversation. What do you guys like about yeah. both? What didn't you like? Do you not go, go to either try place? It. Let us know. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoy it. Go try it. Check it out. Bingo bango, dude. Thanks for watching. Thank you so much. Eat it, bitch. It's always good. It's funny because you look like you're sitting either on a really small toilet. Like, this car is too small for you. <laughs> yeah. It's weird. I just realized that. If you're new here, we're number six with cheese. We upload videos Monday through Friday. All Check different kinds out. of stuff. Food reviews. Tons of stuff. Brewing Beer views, stuff. Mass bang. eating. Inappropriate amounts of eating. Hot food. Tons of spicy food challenges. And a lot of fan interaction. We love the community aspect love of YouTube. It. That's why we're here. Check us out. Check out our Patreon. Like, subscribe on YouTube. You know what to do. You're a you YouTube normal guy, girl. You get it. Animal. Check us out. Bye, Lens. Peace. <laughs>